What's going on, everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com. And in the last Dynasty video, we took on Washington State and ended up getting beat 45-42. to It was a really bad day on defense. Washington State could do no wrong offensively. I threw everything at them, and it just didn't matter. They got their points, and we tried our best offensively to keep up with them. But we had a couple of turnovers that pretty much is the reason why we got beat beyond us playing really bad defense. It's just a bad loss, but we're still ranked. We're 5-3, and three, and everything is still in front of us in terms of our goals, mainly the Pac-10 championship. And today we're going to take on USC for the Pac-10 championship. These are the last two teams that are left. If we beat USC, we're going to win the conference. Hopefully we could do that. Now, they are loaded, as you can tell. With A overall in terms of the roster, they're 7 and 1. You look at their stats, their offense looks pretty okay, but their defense is incredible, apparently. But hopefully, we could play well against their West Coast offense and their 4 3 defense. But before we do that, let's look at a couple of things. Let's go to end season recruiting. Not all was lost when it came to yesterday or the last game we played. Will McDonald committed. This is their top guy we've been going after out of Texas, the strong safety. Now we got three commitments, McDonald, Hall, the middle linebacker, and Johnson, the tackle. We got two guys left. Somehow this strong safety really wants to come to our school. Like we made it to his top five, and we're not even recruiting the kid. Yeah, he really wants to come, but we just we don't really need him. We already got a strong safety and everything. So we're going after two more guys. Andrew Richard, the corner, he is visiting today. He likes our academics, so we're going to pitch the academic pitch. And we got halfback Wesley Larson. For whatever reason, he just can't narrow it down to his top three, but at least we got a positive pitch there. So make sure you stay to the end of the video to see if we pick up Richard's commitment. Let's go to Sports Illustrated. Bowl rankings, we are out of this after that loss to Washington State. But you got Miami, Florida, Michigan, Texas, and USC to start round out the top five. Top 25 polls, we are at the bottom, but we're still in there at 22nd. Then in the media poll, we should be in the same spot close to it. Yes, we are 21st in the media poll. Heisman Watch, we'll check it. We're not involved in it, but it's been pretty consistent. A handful of Miami players with a halfback from West Virginia having an incredible season along with Brandon Cox, the Auburn quarterback. Award semifinalists, we're not going to look at this. In the last video, we saw it. We're not up for anything. We don't have a single player in the top 12 of any award, so we'll just skip that for the rest of the season. Players, until we get to the end of the year, and we can look and see who won them all. Players of the week nationally, wide receiver at a Marshall. When's the last time you heard that? I'm thinking Randy Moss. Apparently, this kid acted like Randy Moss. Had 219 yards, three total touchdowns. Looks like an outside linebacker for Buffalo had a really good game. 12 tackles, a couple of them for loss, a sack, a couple of forced fumbles, and a fumble recovery. Let's look at conference standings. This is what really matters here today. USC, Arizona, 5-1, and 5-1. One, and one. Whoever, and I'm just spitballing, yes, yeah, whoever's going to win is going to win the Pac-10 championship. We got two games left. I'm trying to think. We beat Oregon State. So we could still beat USC. We got one more conference game left after that, and that is Arizona State. So if we finish 6-2, and two, at best, Oregon State would tie with us, and we would still get that win because we beat them. Let's check out our team info screen. We don't have any injuries, thankfully. Rhodes, Henry, and Johnson, that's been pretty consistent the last handful of games. And on the defensive side, Krog stand along, and we still got the bad interception numbers, which we'll talk about that here in a minute. Let's check on USC. Well, at least they got some players hurt. I'm not don't want any players hurt. Don't get me wrong, but it will help us to have some of those guys out. Looks like they got two defensive linemen out with the middle linebacker. So maybe all three are starters, and their vaunted defense will take a step back today. Starting quarterback John David Booty having a pretty good season: 20 touchdowns and nine interceptions. Starting running back, I assume he's a starter. Reed, 86 yards. And then they got a Patrick Turner. He is a Nashville kid. Only reason I remember that is us and USC going after him. He went to USC and didn't really do much. Defensive leaders, Keith Rivers, Keith Rivers, and Keith Rivers. Awesome ball player back in the day, leading in tackles and in interceptions. And leading in sacks as some dude with seven of them. And in the last game, they beat Washington 38-10. to 10. <clears throat> 
the last thing we're going to look at before we head to the game is let's talk about sliders. I want to go over here. We're going to go over to settings. And I made two changes. Okay, let's go over to the CPU offense. I have lowered the running back ability from 50 down to 40. The human running back ability slider is at 40. So I have matched the CPU slider to mine. Obvious reason why we're doing this is just impact halfbacks just go, you know, wild on you pretty much every single game. I'm going to lower just a little bit. It'll help some. They're still going to break some tackles. They're still going to have some really solid gains, uh, games. But hopefully this will just, you know, take a little bit of the EA-ness out of uh, this game, if you know what I'm saying. It just, you know, sometimes the game kind of gets out of the in the way. The other tweak that I made is this right here interceptions i've noticed the last couple of seasons that my interception stats have been super low like we can't get any interceptions whatsoever well the reason for that is i had this at zero don't know why i changed it i don't know if we were just getting a lot of interceptions that first season a lot of it had to do because we had two impact safety so they're gonna make good plays so I lowered it down to zero. Now we can't get hardly anything. So instead of going back to 50, I decided to go right in the middle and do it at 25%. As everybody knows, I'm not a big slider guy. I really don't want to tinker with these, but sometimes you got no choice, and that's just the way I want to play it. All right, let's head into the game. Hey, don't forget to check out the shop on my side. If you go over to playbookgamer.com and under shop, you're going to find a lot of really cool things from books I've written over the years to roster files for all the NCAA football games to game saves for the Madden games on the PlayStation 2. And then I have my vault where I got thousands of files that you can gain access to. I've made some courses and just a bunch of really cool things. Over 40 items are in my shop. Hopefully some of this will be of use to you. I should have links in the description below and above and everywhere else. Looks like we have a night game in Tucson, Arizona. We tend to have a lot of night games. I think the West Coast thing in this game gives a lot of the West Coast teams later games. I don't, I don't think it understands time zones. Let me put it that way. Either way, we got perfect weather. 77 degrees, only, you know, just a little bit of wind. Here's your conference standings. 5-1 and one versus 5-1. and one. This is the game right here. This is your Pac-10 title game. Here come the Arizona Wildcats. Hopefully we can bounce back after that bad loss. And here come maybe the hottest team in the country right now in the USC Trojans. They're going to highlight John David Booty. Third in the country in touchdowns. Tenth in the country in yards. I'm expecting them to pick USC. Let's see what they do. And looks like Lee Corso is putting on the Trojan helmet. All right, let's go to the coin toss. We won it. I want the ball to start second half. And before we look at their rosters, we need to check a couple of things. First of all, in the previous video, I made a comment about doing a couple things philosophically with my play calling. What I'm going to do is normally when you see me call plays, I like to use a lot of formations. Ended up just being, there's a couple of plays out of each formation I just really like, and I go to those. There'll be times where I may literally just run one play out of this formation. There's a lot of times I don't like to do that. It's just habit, I guess. For whatever reason, I just feel like i got to use all my formations. Well, what I'm going to do is try to stick to less of them, if that makes sense. So what we're going to do first is... One criminality thing that I have just, I'm shocked that I haven't thought of this earlier. I don't have but one formation where our two best impact players, Henry and Nichols, on the same formation. We got them in this formation. Ace Big Ten, tight end wide receiver. I always use the sub package to put Nichols right here, and there's Henry. What I'm going to do is go right here, and we're going to put Henry right there. We need these two guys on the field a lot more often together. You just got a better chance of making better plays. So what that means is I am going to leave everything as is. That's another nickel sub package. I am going to have Long Bonds there. We're going to have Henry there. I'm going to leave that. I'm actually going to put Long Bonds right here just to give Henry some relief. Unfortunately, Henry, he just tires very easily, but we're going to let Henry have the trip set. Okay, so that's the only real big adjustment, but you're going to notice when I start calling plays, I'm going to stick to like I-Twins a little bit more, like for three straight plays, 
and then I may move on to something else. We'll see how that goes. It may take me a few games to get adjusted to that. Let's go to dev chart and look at their roster. Starting off, a 94 overall pocket passer in John David Booty. We're not worried about him running, but we're worried about this kid right here. Another impact halfback. Hopefully we can, you know, mitigate his... Uh, him just a little bit. 93 overall, 94 speed. His backup looks pretty good. True freshman, 84 overall, Blake Brown. That must be nice to have. Fullback, not much there. True freshman. Wide receiver, 92, 92, 84. Then it's a drill drop off after that. You look at tight end, 94, 93, 88 speed on this kid. Wow, that's impressive. Look at their tackles or their offensive line. 99, 98, 90, 85. 92, and their worst player is a redshirt freshman at 85 overall. That is an incredible offensive line. Hopefully we can get to the quarterback some today. It will be a challenge. Look at their defense, starting off the edge, 99 and 96 on the edge. And you got 99. This guy's out, thankfully. But they got a 96 and a 95 and an 8. It's just incredible talent. Their front four is the toughest we'll face all year. Linebackers, impact player, 94 overall. Brian Cushing, really good ball player. Middle linebacker, this guy is out, so there's a bit of a weakness here, kind of, sort of, not really, <laughs> at 84 overall. 98, impact guy at right outside linebacker. So there are two outside linebackers or impact guys. Just insane amount of talent across the board. Look at the corners, 86, 84, and 80. Maybe we can exploit this a little bit. We'll see. 84 overall at free safety. 91 at strong safety. So maybe their corners, their free safety, and their middle linebacker, maybe we can attack a little bit today. A really good kicker, and they got just a so so punter. All right. Huge game, a lot on the line, recruiting, Pac 10 championship. Let's see if we can get the job done. That's a good kick. I want it to that guy. Let's see if we can make a tackle. They got an impact running back. I'm expecting them to run it a lot. So let's go with a one high out of 4 3. Right, we're going to do something like this. Get the crowd pumping a little. Went the wrong way. Somebody get stopped. Face mask. Right, out of the gate. Got a face mask. Hopefully it's just a five yarder. Yeah, so we could just treat that as a five-yard game, but they didn't lose the down. Uh, I'm gonna go cover two. Looks like they're going ace and normal. Let's see what they do here. Play action. Make a play, free safety. Good defense. Got a hand on it. That's a good double team. Second and five. We're going to go right here. Well, I'll just do another cover one. I'm going to flip it. Speed option. There he goes. Shoe string tackle. Maybe this is a clipping or a holding. Another face mask? I didn't even see it. I wasn't paying attention. Wow, that's two straight face masks. There's always several every game. Somebody made a comment a couple weeks ago and asking, hey, is there just way too many face masks at my current slide? I got everything set at 70, and for whatever reason, face mask gets called way more than anything else. That may be something I need to lower. Somebody get a stop? Let me pick up five yards there. I think that's their freshman fullback or running back. Let's do another one high. Second and six. Ball on the 46. Uh, yeah, we're gonna leave it as is. USC goes with the ace set here. We'll toss play. Krogstad got stuck on the line, so they're gonna get another first down. Yeah, he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run. Really Yeah, let's do an outside blitz this time. Just throw something different. Ball right around midfield. I would shift, but I'm actually not going to because we got that outside blitz on that right side. Now I should have blitzed, but that's okay. I should have shifted. But our safety, Kleiss, came down with a good stop. Second and nine. We'll do another one high. I fully expect a run. 
That's what I would do. I just keep handing that ball off to Reed. We'll do this. Can I stop him? There we go. That's what? Third and something. Third and seven. I'm going to go Clout. Let's see. We may need to do some extra blitzing on our third and longs because this offensive line is incredible. Maybe I can get around this guy. Oh, good pickup. But he didn't get it. But look where they caught it. Are they going to go for this? They're going to go for it. Ah, I'm going to go dog blitz. I think they're going to run it. They are flipping it. So we're going to do the same thing. We're going to go all out on the run. If they go past, then they'll probably get a touchdown. But that's the chance I'm willing to take. Ooh, they're going past. Wide open. Wow. Good play call. That's the chance I took. I just wasn't expecting that. I was expecting a run. So they're on the scoreboard first. Next time I can go man lock since they've showed me that they're willing to pass it at goal line situations or the fourth and shorts. Let's get on the offense, see if we can tie it. And let's see if my play calling just changes a little bit. Hopefully, I'll enjoy it just a little bit more. We're going to let Deloach take it out. Good defense there. Let's make a couple of adjustments. We'll do that. I'm going to put him, and we're going to do this. Let's just run the ball for now. And I may need to spread them out quite a bit because I think their weakness is their corners. I really wasn't expecting that shift. We'll go to the right. Going to get about five or six yards there. Now, I still got our backup quarterback in here. This is going to be pretty much a running formation for me. So let's just keep running. Uh, let's go something like this. Get a run with Henry. Get a first down. I could go after that. Free safety, but I don't want to just yet. I'm going to go play action, though. They're going zone, but I actually just want to go to Henry on this one. I really don't want Burks to make a crazy play, a, great, a crazy throw. I really don't trust him. So we'll do something like this. Good little play. Get a first down. He haven't seen that play in a while. They just didn't make the play on the so everything's looking pretty decent so far. Let's do a fullback dive. Maybe a bad idea. I normally want to do my use my fullback around the goal line and such, but let's go over here. Just know where to go. Perfect defense. Second and ten. They're all still feeling okay. Let's go speed option. Going zone. I'm going to go to the right. We're going to take a chance there. I'm going to go over here. Did I get the first? That was close. First and ten. Good job. All right. Everybody's still feeling okay, I think. Uh, let's go. I may try to triple play later. Let's just stay in this formation. It's getting us down the field. We're going zone. I'm going to go to the right again. Ah, should have cut up field. That's my fault. Uh, we'll go back. See, I got PA boot I can try, but again, I just want to be careful. I probably need to put Rhodes in here in this formation, but we want to use some option. Get a block. Nope, oh, good block. Just enough of a block by Nichols. We're on the 15. They're both still feeling okay. Well, uh, we can try. Reed, just another run with Henry. We're going zone. Uh, we'll go to the left. Ah, just, you had to pick a side. You know, they got two outside linebackers that are incredible. So not much you can do there. Uh, I may need to... Let's go to a different formation now. Let's pass it a little bit. Okay, at least we spread them out, but they put their two impact guys on the edge. 
Good throw. First down. Great job. I would love to stay in this formation and try to get a touchdown with it. But we're going to just use our goal line situational stuff right here. Let's go full back over. And let's see if we can get in the end zone with our fullback. If this doesn't work, then we can try something else, but we got in. All right, that was a good drive. We scored, went down the field, mostly out of eye twins. The next thing I can do is I can still stick with eye twins and keep sticking with that, or we can spread them out a little bit and try some things there. I'm glad we was able to move the ball on their best base set, which is their 4-3. So I thought our defense played okay in the last drive. We just gave up that last play that I just took a chance on selling out on the run. But we held them to a fourth down. Let's see if we can do that again or something better. This is going to the other guy. But maybe I crushed that kick. No, he's going to return it. Get a good block. Somebody's tackle. Good job. They're going with the bigger set. We'll go with a 4-3, though. Uh, they are doing... We'll do this. Awesome. I'm going to get a stop. Good job. Let's go... I'm going to go quarters and a nickel. That's the end of the quarter, by the way. Seven all. A very simple quarter for both teams. Just go down the field and score. And that's the end of the first quarter, and we've got a tie ball game. Second, uh, now I kind of want to know. Let, let's just go ahead and do quarters. I think they may pass it. Ball on the 14-yard line. The Trojans. We'll do Black something like this. Yeah. Let's see what they call. Booty, One pass. Going with a little screen to the halfback or technically the fullback, but it didn't work. So it's third and nine. We got to get a stop here. We've done a good job on the last third down. Let's see if I can get to it from here. I'm going up against a really good tackle. Oh, good play by the... Get it, get it, get it! Overshot it. He overshot the throw. That's a huge stomp right there, so let's get the ball back. We're going to get decent field position. we got to score on this drive. Perfect opportunity right here. Let's see if we can take advantage of it. Oh, he almost had a chance to block that thing. Somebody get a... Oh, no, it's not going to happen. No, 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 no! I didn't... I was trying to fair catch, and it didn't work. Let's go. Uh, let's spread them out. And let's just see what happens. Okay. Let's go with this double screen. Let's stay in trips for a little bit. So they're going man dime. We'll go to McCoy regardless. Good little play there. Good little play. And a face mask. Oh, you got to call it. They didn't call it, but that's okay. It's a good play, though. Let's go P. Reed. Man dime again. I will probably hand the ball off. I like what I'm seeing here. I like the numbers. So we're going to take advantage of that and get a first down. Did we get it? I think we did. Second and in inches, we didn't. <laughs> okay. Uh, we can try. What do I have? Let's go angle. Second down and short. Ball on the 36 yard Who is on who? We will either go to Thomas, well, or we may have to go to Marks. Now, looks like we're going to go to Marks. Ooh, ooh, geez, that was, wasn't the best throw. Great catch by Marks. We'll get the first down there. Let's do another screen. We're going man. So we're going to go over to Johnson. We're going to let them shift over a little bit. There we go. Good throw. Going to pick up five or so. Second and five. I'm going to go... Uh, let's go... QB choice. Let's just hand the ball off to Henry. Let's see if we can find a crease on the left side. Ooh, I love that shift. We're going to get some number. Just cut up field. No, why don't, I didn't mean to spin. <laughs> I accidentally hit the button. Did not mean to do that. All right, first and ten. I may go. Is he? How's he feeling? He's still feeling okay. I am probably going to run that same play again. I don't think fifteen. I will probably go back to double screens. We're kind of running out of room. 
That's what I'm thinking at the moment. So who's on who? We're going to go to Thomas on this one. Eh, just not a whole lot there. I think what we need to do now is let's go back to our bread and butter. And let's just run the ball from under center. I want to throw some play action in here. I just don't know if Burks can handle it consistently. We're going to go to the right. Get a block or two. Get a block or two. Did not get the first, but that's okay. What yard are we on? Are we on the seven or the six? We're on the seven. I'm actually probably need to go goal line. This is our goal line formation, more or less. Let's go with slam from here. Can we get the first down? We'll go over here. Just, I think we got it. I didn't get it. Oh, you got to be kidding. I, I'm, I'm going to go for it. I just don't want to kick a field goal. I want to beat this team. We're not going to beat them on field goals, I don't think. I hope I'm not regretting it. Right Woo! Just enough. <laughs> barely, barely, barely. First and goal. All right, let's give Henry a break. I'm going to go back to this formation. Let's go to Nichols. Give him a couple of snaps until we get Henry back in there, if needed. Who, man, that took some guts right there. Get a block for somebody. Just don't fumble it. That's a good stop. I'm going to go to him again. We're going to go to this goal line formation. Well, it's not goal line. It's just, it's the Nichols formation. Oh, I forgot they're going goal line. I completely forgot about that. That was a mistake. I am going to run some, no, let's call a timeout. That's not the play I want to call. We got time. Let's see. Offensive line. Let's just go slim. Let's go back to Henry. I probably should have cut down the time on that one. Should have killed a little clock, but that's okay. Let's get a touchdown there. So we got the lead. There's still plenty of time in the quarter. They got all three of their timeouts. We should have at least one chance to get the ball back. Depending. Kick the extra point. I may have missed this. Ooh, that was close. 14 to 17. A great first half so far. Good drive down the field. I'm liking my play call, and I think I'm enjoying it more. It just it simplifies it for me. If I just kind of stick with the formation for a little bit, then if I feel like when it gets to situational stuff, your third and fourth downs and your goal line, your red zone, then I can switch it up. Otherwise, I can stick with some base. Bumble, somebody get it, get it, get it, get it. Huge play, huge play right there. Who made the hit? Who forced the fumble? Let's see who, when I was talking, what paying attention. Let's go down here, boom, 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 boom. Let's go right here. Somebody hit him, I just don't know who. Kind of hard to tell. It was a big old scrum, anything could have happened here. I guess that was 34. That was Tatum. I don't even know who you are, but I'm glad you made the play. That's huge, that's huge. And I got to put my, I got to switch this back up. There we go. Get him back in there. We're on the 21. I think we need to run the ball some more. Let's go counter. We haven't called that today. It's first and 10. Ball on the 21 yard line. I'd love to chew up the rest of this clock before the half. They line up in an eye. Hey, get to that side. Just great defense. My tight end got blasted. Look at this. Just I had nowhere to go. I guess I should have cut up instead of out, but he just got pushed so badly. So that's going to force me out of that formation. Second and 15. Let's just go here and we got plenty of time. Let's just go stick. We don't need all the 15 yards just yet. Go in zone. I love to hit Bale over the middle. It's going to happen though. And a bad throw. Bad throw by Nichols. Not by Nichols, but by Rhodes. Third and 15. Forced a bad throw. Ah, oh, this is going to be, should I throw in it? We'll go tight and cross. And they're going, man, this is going to be really hard. We're not going to get a first down off of this. Unless they go cover zero. We'll throw it anyways, but they're going cover one. Oh, oh, geez. I don't know what that was, but that corner played that one so perfectly. 
We're very fortunate he did not decide to pick it up, you know, intercept it. Very fortunate right there. Oh my gosh, we dodged a bullet. That was an awful throw. Don't know what Rhodes was doing there. So let's see if we can get the field goal. I'm not the best at these. This is going to be a tough one. I'll do something terrible. I missed it big time. That's just, just not my fault. Just a bad play on my part. I hit the button too early. All right, let's see if we can survive the next minute. Unfortunately, we couldn't take advantage of that turnover. Their defense was incredible on that drive. Oh, missed it. I missed it. Oh, you got to be kidding. You got to be kidding. Really? You got to be kidding. What an amazing play that was. What do you do with that? He threw it off the back foot and forced a terrible throw when I just goofed up right there. So I guess that's my fault. But everybody else is just going uh, just awful. Oh. Terrible play. Wow. Be huge for them. Was not expecting that. Uh, I'm going to leave it as he is. No, we'll, we're going to shift him over. I'm going to pass it. Intercept it. Second and goal. I'm going to do another one high. If I was them, I'd hand the ball off. Ooh, they're going ace empty. I forgot they had this formation. This is definitely a pass. He went for the QB draw. Interesting. Third and goal from the eight. If we could hold him to a field goal, that would be miraculous. I'm going to go zone. If I go man, they're going to hit an easy man beater. And I don't want to see that. Let's do something like this instead. Went with the toss play. And they got the easy touchdown. I was not expecting that. So they capitalized on their defensive drive from earlier. And they're going to tie this thing. I was not expecting a basic toss play, which rarely works in this game, but it usually works for them. I've said it a million times. I've, I can never get that toss play to work for me. I guess you got to call against certain defenses. 45 seconds. Can we get some of those points back before the half? We're going to have to throw the ball a whole lot better than we did on the last drive. That's a kick and a half right there, but we're going to have a chance at this one if we can get a block or two. Nobody blocked. Okay. First and 10. We're going to have to get down the field. And I've also got to get out of bounds. Let's go halfback out. This may be kind of tough. I could go over the middle, but I don't want to throw an interception either. And I got hit when I threw it. He's still getting a first down out of that somehow. <laughs> oh, I, I don't think I got out of bounds. I'm going to have to call a timeout. That was a crazy play. Okay. Uh, let's go halfback screen. I'm just trying to think of ways to get out of bounds. And we got one timeout left. Throw this one quick. Get about five yards. Second and six. I got to get down the field a little bit more. Uh, we can try. I don't know if this will work. Angle. I'm going to take a chance here. I don't know if that's... Mm, uh, this may be tough. I may not. I don't think I need to do that. Ah, uh, great defense. And then drop calling a timeout. I think I'm going to let this play go. I think we're just going to go to half. I think that's a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. I just, I don't want to throw an interception. That last drive scared me with Rhodes. He made some terrible throws. And I don't trust him to thread the needle between those safeties right now. It's just not worth it. I don't want to throw an interception. So let's just go to half. We're going to tie this thing. And let's regroup. We're going to get the ball started second half. 14 to 14. That'll do it for the first half here. We're tied. Let's check out some stats. 142 to 154 for us. Both it's it's a defensive battle, I guess, if you look at it that way. We're not doing a good job on third down. They're not doing a very good job of it either. They had one turnover, but we couldn't capitalize on it, so they dodged the bullet there. Uh let's go to individual stats. Rhodes is eight of ten, but I'm throwing short stuff right now. All of the drop there's actually we don't have any drops. All of the incompletions have been deep ball type stuff, or that one out route that was just dreadful. Otherwise, I think we're okay here. I'm just trying to, 
you know, avoid interceptions. Uh, Henry, we need to keep giving him the ball. 12 rushing attempts. He's got a touchdown, and he's got two receptions. Nobody's got any big yards in the passing game. Everybody's got the touch the ball. As you can tell, we've got like seven different guys got to catch it. Let's go to defense. Lopez, Palmer, Kleiss, Barnett, uh, just a bunch of dudes with two tackles apiece. A handful of tackles for loss. That's not bad. No sacks and no interceptions. Hey, don't forget to check out the shop on my site. If you go over to playbookgamer.com and under shop, you're going to find a lot of really cool things from books I've written over the years to roster files for all the NCAA football games to game saves for the Madden games on the PlayStation 2. And then I have my vault where I got thousands of files that you can gain access to. I've made some courses and just a bunch of really cool things. Over 40 items are in my shop. Hopefully some of this will be of use to you. I should have links in the description below and above and everywhere else. We need to score on this drive. We need to continue to have a lead. I don't want to come back from behind on this team. They won that second quarter. I'm not even going to bother on this one. I don't trust our special teams blocking. Let's just go back here. This has been our best formation so far. Let's just stick with it for a little bit. Arizona sets up in the eye. Like, per perfect defense. Just came right on through. Nobody blocked that guy. Not a single person. Second and 11. I'm not going to attack that strong safety. I can't do it. Let's just go slam and see what we can do here. Uh, we'll go to the left. Get a block or two. Dang it. Get a block or two. Great job. Shoot. Thank the Lord he's an impact player. Thank the Lord. Oh, man. God bless number 27. Now, I'm going to try it here. We're going to PA boot. And they're going man. I'm actually thankful they're doing that. So we got two really solid options. The fullback or Johnson over the top. Cover zero and a sack. Dang it. Now that puts me in a terrible situation. Second and forever. Uh, we'll go tight end dig. Now it forces me to throw. They're going man. I'm going to go make that play. Ah. It wasn't the worst throw ever. Yeah, they went cover one. That's why I went to that. Unfortunately, it's third and forever. So let's just... Just great defense. I, I got to remind myself, we're going up against the best defense in the country, apparently. And this one is not going to go for a first down unless they go cover zero. No, they're going cover zero. Make a play, Marks. Make a play! Huge play! Huge play! Go! 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 Oh, great throw, Rhodes. Great catch, freshman. Marks. Incredible play right there. They went cover zero. Was not expecting that. It was third and 100 yards to go, and they brought everybody down. Oh, my gosh. Let's regroup. And let's run the ball. Let's just punch it in. Let's just get a touchdown. Here they're going zone. Look at that defensive line. I mean, what do you do with that? Just, uh, good play, Henry. Let's give him. Oh, he is really feeling it. So let's just give him the ball. He's really pumped. So they got their impact guy over there. And they're going zoo. We're going to go to the left. The Wildcats. Ah, that was my fault. I could have played that one better. I'm going to go back to the same play. Third and goal. I don't care. I goofed up on that one. I should have cut up. There we go. So we got the lead back. Now we got to get back on defense and try to stop them. Our tight end, or actually that was Nichols on the back end, if I'm not mistaken. He had the block at the last second to punch it in. I'm going to try to give him the ball when we get around the goal line again. See if he can give him another touchdown. Or has he got one yet? Is it all Henry so far? I think Nichols has got one. Back to defense we go. And we just need to stay ahead of him. Maybe get a break or two. Maybe we can get a two-score lead on him. A really good kick. It's not strong, but it's not going to their impact guy, at least. 
Good tackle by whoever that is, 26. I should know my own players by now. Let's go back to one high. If you go back and look, I didn't pay attention to this. They, yes, they ran the ball a little bit more than they threw it. So I expect them to continue to do that. I, if I was them, that's what I would do. So let's see if they do that. Nope, they're going to pass it. Great throw. Wow. Why, I mean, just... Just perfect play. It was the perfect throw. Per hey, look, hey, did you see that extra ju juice he got right there? Got a little extra yardage on him. And after that, look what happened. The ref got in the way. I don't need a 12th man out there. The I'll leave. Oh, well, so let's go and get that touchdown back. Man, that's okay. Let's just get back on offense and continue to do our thing. First play out of the gate. Boom, touchdown. And the ref helped him out. He blocked both of our guys. They're both safeties. Just bad luck there. Bad, bad luck. Let's see if we can change that. I want to see a block or two. I'd love to go right up the seam here. Like that. Good play, Deloach. Good job. Get it down to the 38 or so. I'm going to go back to Twins. Let's just stick with it. It's worked really well for us today. As long as we get a good gain on the first play. That's a good shift by them. I'm going to go to the right. Ooh, got to bounce to the outside. Did not get the first. Second and inches. Let's just go slam. Second down and short. And they're going five two. Uh, where do you go in this situation? I'm gonna go to the left. Just get a first down, just enough. From here, I want to give Henry a bit of a break. Let's go halfback straight. Let's go gun normal for a while. We're going zone. Let's get Rhodes a going. They blitz with their linebacker. That's good. Get about seven or eight yards there. I want to try a halfback streak. Let's do a, a shallow wrap. They're going zone. I'm going to keep this simple. We're just going to go to Thomas. High snap. Ah. His hands and incomplete. Dropped by the wideout. Uh, second and three. We're going to do an option play. Going back to what we do best, our run game. I'm just going to pitch it. I'm just going to let him handle it. <laughs> Might as well get a first down. Just let him handle it. <laughs> no big deal. I could have kept it. I got spooked right there. I just like forget it. Just go to 27, be done with it. First and ten. They're still feeling okay. I am. I'm gonna spread them out. Let's do. Let's just spread them out a little bit. Now we're in the red zone, so we can kind of do things a little differently. I want to get that extra linebacker off the field. Face mask. Thank you. We finally got one. That's a five-yarder. First and four. How's he feeling? He's still okay. I'm going to go... Where's it at? I was looking for it. There it is. Quick slants. Man dime. Not what I was wanting. Per great defense. Yeah, that was just a perfect defensive call on that part. Second and eight. He is kind of pumped. I'm going to go right back to him. Let's just hand the ball off. Back to man dime. Just keep those safeties up there. That would be great. They're backing up their linebacker. That's interesting when they're doing that. Get a first down. I think he's a little gassed. I think he's kind of pooped. Uh, I'm going to go. Let's give him a, just a bit of a break. Let's go to Nichols. Hopefully Nichols can handle this. I'm going to go to the right, I guess. Just nothing. Nowhere to go. Good defensive call. Second and goal. 
Um, let's go basic slam. Thank the Lord for that shift. But that safety's coming down. That means that linebacker's probably blitzing. But we're going to go to the outside anyways. Great defense. There's nowhere to go. Um, so what we're going to do... I'm not going to throw it. I don't want to throw an interception. So we're going to go back to that option play. I just want to keep it... I just don't want to throw an interception. It's just not worth it down here. I want points. Oh, no! Jeez! That was my fault. Let's kick the field goal. I should have went to the outside. Man, I shouldn't have pitched it either. Let's see if I can just make the field goal. Should be right down the middle. Okay, well, at least we got some points there. That was not my best doing, but again, their defense is really good. It's If you think about it, it's a miracle we got 24 points on them. Their defense is so solid. It feels like we're fighting for every yard. And they'll be returning this one. All right, back to our defense. Can we get a stop? That last drive, uh, these one-play drives are no fun to, <laughs> to see. And they're going with the one high. Uh, let's go one high ourselves. Uh, we'll just do something like this. Fullback dive. Good stop right there by the defensive tackle. And Dotson. I'm going to go cover two. Looks like they're going right back to that same formation. Went to the exact same play. They're going to get a first down off of it. What in the world? Golly, I was not expecting that. Went back to the exact same play. I'm going to tell you. I think the defense needs to make some adjustments. Let's do a one high. Eight or nine guys into the box. Coach, maybe they can slow this running game down. You're right. Let's see if we can get a break. Let's see if we can get a fumble. Crockstad right on through there. That's why I blitz with him. So he can make a play like that. That is end of the third quarter. 24 to 21. Get your fingers up. Fourth quarter. Let's see if we can pull off the big upset. I'm going to go, it, my heart is telling me to go with a zone blitz. I think they're going to throw it, and I'm going to blitz this cat. And I'm going to bring him with him at myself. Normally I don't do this. They picked up the blitz. Excellent. Oh, but we still got to him. Nice. I got around the tackle. So it's third and forever. I'm actually going to go man cover two since it's so deep. I don't want to take any chances. So I'm going to just do something like this. Get him, get him, get him. Off the back foot. Look at this throw. you got to be kidding. Jeez. Golly, what do you do with that? He threw it off the back foot again. Forced him to come back for it. And our corner just whipped it. Or, or no, that was a linebacker. Golly, wasted opportunity. Man, we could have gotten them off the field right there. And we just couldn't. Go back and look at that quarterback right here. Look at this. Threw it off the back foot. Jeez, what a throw. Got to be careful with the... I'm going to do this instead. Pass it. Out route. We're going to get about six or seven right there. I'm going to go with another zone blitz. It worked last time. I'm going to control the defense at the end. I'm going to let the CPU handle it. They may just straight up run it. Going fullback dive again. Look at that gaping hole. Ali, they're going to get 20 yards out of it. I hate seeing plays like that. A fullback slower Moses. Get 20 yards of pop. We just can't get him off the field. We're struggling right now defensively all of a sudden. Don't know why. But the guy haven't gotten the end zone yet. Uh, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Great stop. We just kind of pushed everybody just enough. Picking a 13. I'm going to go quarters. I think they're going to throw. Maybe I can bait this guy to a pick. Intercept that. 
he dropped it. I think he dropped it. Ooh, looks like the defender made the play on it. Third and long. If we can hold him to a field goal, man, that would be something. Let's see if I can get to him myself. And a sack! <laughs> I got through! I got through! Got around the left tackle. So they're going to kick the field goal. And they got a really good kicker, so he should make this. But here's the situation. We got less than three minutes to go. And I'm going to get the ball back. I'm going to run clock. We're going to go right down the field. We're going to try to score. Hopefully chew up that entire clock. Looks like they're going to chew up some clock themselves. Ali, what a game. The kick is up. Perfect kick. He had another 30 yards added to it. But we kept him out of the end zone. Hey, what a great defensive battle. I think our defense, uh, they definitely played way better today than they did in the last game. All right, middle of the field. We're going to let that one go. I'm going to go right back to our bread and butter. Let's go back to that option play. Let's just stick with I twins for a little bit. We're going zone. Guess we'll go to the right. Do something like this. Good play by Burks. And Burks is hurt. Injured his shoulder. Ooh. Hopefully it's not serious. Let's run it. And they're going 5-2. I hope they shift their line somewhat. I guess we're going to the right, aren't we? Let's go to the right. We're going to run a little clock. If we could just get down there and kick a field goal and end it, that would be amazing. Get a block or two. Good block right there. Face mask. Oh, you got to call it. Come on, call it. First and 10. I am... Um, Let's give him, let's get a, let's pick another formation. It's first and ten. Burks is out for three weeks. Well, there goes our option game. What that means is that clock's still running. What that means is I'll just treat it as a toss play. We need to get a block on this linebacker on the left. I could shift somebody over, but I'm going to, I'm not going to. Get it down to a couple of seconds, get a block right there. That's what we want right there. First down. Is he still feeling okay? Is he, yeah, he's still okay. So what we can do, we can go back to this. I'm going to run the toss. We'll just treat it as a toss play because Rhodes is too slow. No offense to him. A lot of hard shift. and looks like we're double teaming the X receiver. We're going to continue to run some clock. I still got three timeouts if needed. Get down to a few seconds. Just pitch it. Great defense. Face mask, call it. Thank you. Thank you. That's face mask number six on the day. <laughs> That's a five yarder. And guess what? Ooh, he hit. Hell, he's really pumped. I, um, oh, geez. I'm going to go back to Henry, but I think he's kind of gassed. They're going zone. I probably didn't. I picked the wrong play. We're going to go back to the exact same one, though. I should have went the Nichols. That was my fault. Go ahead and snap it. Get a blocker to first down. Good play there. He's kind of gassed. So what we're going to do... I need to get him out of a formation. Let me go... Formation subs. I'm going to get long bonds in there. See, I want to go to Nichols, but he's just too slow at the moment. We're going to go back and run the ball some more. 43 seconds. I hope we don't turn the ball over. I'm going to call a timeout. Second and set. Let's think about this. Let's go screen. They're going zone. Now what I'm going to do, now that we've called the timeout, Henry should be okay again. I'm going to go back to Henry right there. If we got to go back to that formation. Get out of bounds. Third and four. 
Brett. I don't know what the quarterback saw, but hey. I'm going to go back to a toss with Henry. Third down and four coming up on this one. If we don't get the first down, I don't I don't know what we'll do. We'll figure it out. High formation here. Rose. Get a block right there. Get a block right there. And guess what? Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to... We're going to ISO. Well, I'm just going to leave it as is. I don't need to do anything else. I think I'm just going to call the timeout with like two seconds to go. We're going to kick the field goal and we're going to end it. I was going to go into the middle of the field, but I don't want him to get hit and fumble it. It's just not worth it. So we're just going to do something like this. Do something like that. We'll call a timeout. We're going to go backfield. I want to make sure my kicker gets as much juice as possible. And it's up to me to make this kick. Hopefully we can pull off the big upset. Win the Pac-10 championship. All that good stuff. So fingers crossed. Let's see if I can make the play. Go over here. Game over. Game over. Game over. Pac-10 champions once again. Boom! 27 to 24. How about them Wildcats? Man, we needed that win so badly. We'll probably get the commitment from the cornerback, the local kid in Richard. Oh my gosh, what a great game that was. Very fun defensive battle. I went to Henry as much as I could. Just give him the ball, give him the ball, give him the ball. Our defense played so great. Thanks for joining us. It would have been great if they would play a little bit better in the last game, but that's gone. We can't worry about that anymore. It doesn't matter. We're Pac-10 champions. That means we're going to play, guess what, in the Rose Bowl. Unless something goofy happens. We should play in the Rose Bowl. I don't think any of the weird bowl things are going to mess up on us. Let's go to stats. 348, they're 271. A lot of those, dude, we just, we ran the clock. I didn't run the clock until like the fourth quarter. But we met, we kept the chains moving. That was the big thing. But 210 yards rushing. I just decided it was just best to run the ball. It just didn't make sense for us to throw it. Rhodes had a really bad drive or two that scared me. And I said, forget it. Just go to your running back and let him carry the load. And that's what we did. We've done a whole lot better on third down. Four for seven for 57%. They went 40%. Big thing, not a single turnover. We kept it clean. They had the one, even though we couldn't capitalize on it. Let's go to individual stats. So when it comes to this, Burks is out for the remainder of the regular season. Unless we got a bye week that I'm not aware of. He'll be back for the bowl game. But I'll have to adjust some things, uh, more or less. But Rhodes, 11 to 15, but only 63 yards. I kept it short. I just didn't want to throw anything goofy. I didn't want an interception. We avoided that, thankfully. Running the ball. There's the big cat. Two, 28 attempts, 181 yards, two touchdowns. And we finally had a, a double-digit broken tackle game. I, that's the first one I've had. I can't tell you when. I, it just kind of occurred to me he had quite a few. We'll tank that 10. Now, I think their running back didn't do enough. He only had how many attempts? He only had 10, 7 touches. I don't know why they didn't go to him more. He's in, not him. Where's he at? This kid right here. Yeah, he only had 7 attempts. They should have went to him like double that. But thankfully he didn't. And he didn't have a single broken tackle. That's really weird to see that. But, of course, he's really small, and that may be the reason why he's just not very strong. Uh, that's probably it. Either way, good to see Henry have 28 attempts on the ground. He had three receptions, so he had 31 touches in this game. Marks is our best receiver of the day, 22-yard average off of three receptions. But we didn't have a single passing touchdown, but we didn't need it. Defensively, Parker, Vickers, Krogstad, Palmer, three tackles apiece. Tackles for loss, we got... Parker leading that one. He must have just had, or I guess he was our defensive player of the game. He even had a sack, so it's all Parker today. And we still didn't get any interceptions, but that's okay. Hey, don't forget to check out the shop on my site. If you go over to playbookgamer.com and under shop, you're going to find a lot of really cool things from books I've written over the years to roster files for all the NCAA football games to game saves for the Madden games on the PlayStation 2. Then I have my vault where I got thousands of files that you can gain access to. I've made some courses and just a bunch of really cool things. Over 40 items are in my shop. Hopefully some of this will be of use to you. I should have links in the description below and above and everywhere else. As you can see, we did not get the commitment from Richard. We can go ahead and look at that, see what happened here. In season recruiting. And there he is. He's a soft verbal, but maybe he hasn't visited Oklahoma yet. Or Texas A&M. 
But we're putting 50 points on the kid, and at least the halfback, Wesley Larson, has finally decided to narrow down to his top three. We're going to have him come for the South Carolina game. We only got one home game left, so we got no choice but to have him come for that one. All right, let's check out the top 25 scores for the week. We'll go to weekly. We'll go to top 25. We upset USC, and now we're 14th in the country. Then we got Virginia. Michigan still undefeated. Iowa, 9-1. and one. Then you have Texas. A&M got upset. Illinois, Georgia over Ole Miss. Then you have Florida, Houston, Oklahoma, Nebraska ranked. Tennessee, left in the country. Go balls. LSU got upset. South Carolina won. They're 5-4. Maybe we can beat them here in a couple weeks. That'd be great. Oregon State over Washington. And we got Cal and then Georgia Tech over Virginia. All right. We are officially Pac-10 champions. We can go check out uh, Sports Illustrated. We got one conference game left. We'll look right here. One conference game left, and we got a one-game lead over everybody. We can lose to Arizona State and still win the Pac-10 championship because we beat both Oregon State and USC. That is just awesome. Two Pac-10 championships in three years. We'll definitely take it. Next up, our arch rival, 3-7 and seven, Arizona State. Last time we played a losing team, I felt good going in, and we didn't play well at all. Hopefully, we'll have a whole lot better game in this one. They got less talent than we do. Looks like they throw the ball extremely well, but they don't do much of anything else well. Let's see if we can take care of business, finish the conference season strong, and look for just greater things to come as the season winds down. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later.